There's a new collab bug in the game. Let's check it out. Okay, in this video, I'm going to show you how to get the collab bug, the new one, and then I'll show you all the new gear they added this week, two for one in this video. So first, uh, to get the clad bog, it's pretty easy. It's how you get the old clad bog the exact same way. So you need Legion Titan armor. You need the altar of clad bog, this thing right here. You need to grab the quest for it. And this quest has a 5% confirmed 5% chance of dropping the brand new sword. Uh, to that quest, you slash join uh, Underworld. And you kill a skeleton. It's as easy as can be i'd recommend quest glitching the window open and teleporting here it took me three turn in three or four turn ins to do it so it didn't take that long so just kill this guy over and over again it's like one kill and some legion tokens per turn in really easy and you should get it pretty fast so that's how you get the new collab bug that was added to the game now this week we actually had a pretty decent release uh which included a lot of really cool items i'll quickly go through every item <laughs> you can hold them in your hand if you want to a new armor in the merch shop and there was also a quite a few drops available for this event which is pretty cool i think this one's new here today these all ac tag uh you get them with the dollars uh the dollars don't drop off monsters like normal merge items they go from requests i guess you get one per turn in quests really easy and self-explanatory if you play through the quest line uh some people had a problem with the quest to go to the boat uh all you do is you follow the rocks down the middle so you just go up right there right there and then it brings you in there and that's how you do that quest if you walk like this it'll drop you into a cutscene, or at least it should or maybe because i completed it it doesn't now but if you do if you go the wrong way it, it'll drop you into a cutscene. so the drops i'll be showing in this video are on the bus so if you run in here not in this one not in this cabin wrong cabin okay so if you go in this cabin up here through the window there's the boss of course if you you gotta finish the quest line, I'm pretty sure I get to here. That's a weird armor. I haven't seen that in a while. I've seen that armor before. Alright, so if you run all the way at the end, Sherrod, Charade, however you say it, is right here. That's the boss. He has the drops. Let me go over them really quick. Alright, let's start off with the armor, which I think is a 1% drop. It took a long time of farming to get it, so it's the Shadow Cultist Armor. It's the female version of it on my character right there. Uh, it's not a bad armor, but I wouldn't prefer it over one of my other armors. The Death Hunter hood, uh, which looks a little weird on female characters, but it's a pretty nice looking hood. I really actually like how it looks. I wish it fit better, but yeah. There's the Death Hunter locks, which look like this. Uh, it's the same as these. Uh, there's a male version of the locks, but I didn't get them, I guess. So it's just that hair without the face, like it doesn't transform your face. You get to keep the face from the armor, if that's your preference. Uh, this is from the shop for ACs. And there are three more hoods. So we got this hood, which is really, really spoopy. And this one, which is member only, but AC tag with the horns on it. And the last hood is this one from the enemies, of course. All right, those are all the drops from the boss itself. Now let's go through the other monsters in the area and what drops they have. There are no drops from these two enemies. None from these either. But from the cultists, there are three different drops. You have the single knife, which I have in my hand right now. And the dual cultist knife, which is member tag, the single one is not. So dual one for members. And then you also have a house item. So if I have it equipped in my house right there, there is the house item. So there's three items that drop off of those guys. All right, from the fish people down here, there is a trident. My inventory is full, oh, well, that's great. Trident's equipped on my character. The fish people are under the boat, of course, from earlier in the video. Pretty cool trident, actually. I, I like this weapon. All right, now the last Last, last, last item from this area that I'm aware of, at least, uh, from my uh, looking around on the internet. See, that's a sign here. Why do I keep going in that one? If you go up here, in the back to the boss, there was a second boss. If you played the quest line, you would have known about him, about her, not him. So if you got to run to the very, very, very end, let's go over here and battle the bride. So this bride, uh, 2k health, not a lot. Uh, you get what's on her head. So I'll farm it real quick to show you on my character. All right, here is the helmet and my inventory is full again. Here's the helmet on my character. There it is. That is the last item from this area. Thank you guys for watching this video. Leave a like if you liked it. Subscribe to the channel if you're not already. I make videos like this all the time. And 
that is all. Make sure you hit the bell icon if you want to see more videos from me and follow my Twitch channel down in the description. I'll see you guys all in the next one. Peace.